Hi everyone, it's Renee. Welcome to Desserts for the Weekend. We're going to be making in this sunflower huge cupcake cake. The original idea is from Martha Stewart. The first thing we're going to be doing is the cupcakes themselves. And for this one, I'm going to be using the cupcake butter that I do have to tutorial on. And I'm going to be putting my mini cupcake pan and then I'm going to be using my mini cupcake wrappers. Now to have an even amount of my batter in each and one of my cupcakes, I'm gonna be using my candy funnel that I bought on Michael's, it's from Wilton, but you can use a spoon. This is easier for me and it's less messy. And I'm just going to fill half my cupcake wrappers. Then I'm going to be baking them for no longer than 10 minutes each. Oven is different. I would suggest to keep an eye on it. And then you're going to let your mini cupcakes cool. And while my cupcakes are getting cold and ready for me to use them, I'm just going to be working on my frosting, which is going to be pretty much heavy cream. I use half a cup or maybe three quarters of a cup for this amount of cupcakes. Then I divided the frosting, the total of my frosting into four different bowls. And you're going to be working with a lighter jello then a darker yellow, then an orange, and then a tiny bit for the black. Once my cupcakes were cold and I had my frosting colored, I'm going to go and take my spatula and for the lighter yellow, for the darker yellow, and for the orange, I'm going to just go ahead and frost that. I do have a tutorial dedicated to just that and for the black one I just took my black frosting, placed it inside of a ziplock bag and then just start to make kind of dots. The original idea took some sort of berries but I didn't have any. This is just an option, you can add many more things. So in total you're going to be needing 7 black mini cupcakes, 20 orange mini cupcakes, 21 darker yellow mini cupcakes and 19 lighter yellow mini cupcakes. And in total according to me you're going to be only working with 67 mini cupcakes. The original recipe if you check it out is going to ask you for 75 but this worked for me. And well once you have all your cupcakes lined up and ready for the action here comes the fun part. First you're going to put your black mini cupcakes putting one in the center and then working your way around that i think there are many ways that you can achieve the shape but this is the one that i saw it was faster once you have your black mini cupcakes you're going to line up around those 11 orange mini cupcakes that's going to be like the line number one here is where it kind of starts getting tricky but i'm going to slow it down for you you're just going to place one darker yellow followed by one orange another darker yellow another orange two darker yellows one orange then two darker yellows another orange two darker yellows another orange two darker yellows followed by one orange and then just adding one darker yellow again and that is going to be line number two now in the middle of that darker yellow and that orange you're going to place an orange a lighter yellow two darker yellow followed by one lighter yellow, an orange, a lighter yellow, four lighter yellows, an orange, two darker yellows, followed by three lighter yellows, two darker yellows, followed by three lighter yellows, and then one darker yellow. For the next row, which is the fourth one, we're just going to add one lighter yellow right between the previous lighter yellow and the orange. One lighter yellow right between those dark ones, one lighter yellow in between that light one and the orange one, one darker yellow in between those two light ones and again repeating the same here, one lighter yellow in between the orange and the darker yellow, one lighter yellow in between the darker and the lighter yellow. It gets kind of tricky as you go on one lighter in between those lighter, one lighter in between those darker ones, and then one darker in between those lighter ones. And then to make it look more like a flower rather than random cupcakes arranged like that, I'm just going to place a branch and some leaves that I found on the street. I didn't, you know, took anything from nature, don't worry. If you like this idea, don't forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more stuff. Don't forget, I upload every Friday baking stuff. It's called desserts for the weekend. And don't forget to share and check out my blog as well. If you recreate this idea, send it over to my Instagram and Twitter. I would love to check it out. I think this idea would be awesome in a, you know, one summer party in one of those tables full of streets. This could be there. So talk to you in my next video. Thank you so much for watching and take care.